All right, uh, let's get the recording going. We're going to do a live demo, but uh, these are always safer to do. Um, I already showing enough stuff live, so we're gonna, just going to show you a uh, recording of this part. What I have running is a Jetson uh, Nano, which I'm going to show you the uh, Nano itself uh, here shortly. Um, and uh, Jetson Nano is a uh, single board computer, uh, lots of power. Uh, I also have other types of uh, single board computers, which I will probably show you as well uh, today. This one happens to be a security robot. It's on four wheels and uh, has uh, a camera. This is also the base for most of my projects. When I'm ever I'm, uh, I'm deciding to build something new, I start off with this robot, and because it already has the the kind of basics of computer vision, uh, motion, and uh, path and planning, which we're all going to explain what those things are. But uh, let's get started. So in here, I am I'm inside of the Jetson Nano single board computer operating system. Uh, this is uh, called Ubuntu. Uh, operating system. It's a Linux-based operating system, uh, and this is a specific one for the Jetson Nano. As you can see, the the uh, logo in the background of NVIDIA. Um, it's a very cool operating system. Very powerful. First thing I want to do is uh, go to my workspace. Uh, it's my workspace folder I have opened up right now, and if I ls that folder, you can see it has um, some files inside. It's also a, a GUI-based uh, graphical user interface-based file system uh, that I can click on, but uh, it'd be super cool. I'm going to do all this in the command uh, uh, line. The first thing I want to do is build my uh, project to just make sure I haven't done anything uh, weird that would have broken the project in the time that I haven't used it. All right, it's going ahead and building. I'm going to open up a second window while we're doing this. Um, and can't hear my baby crying in the background. And I'm going to open up a code editor. This one is uh, Visual Studio Code. It's going to open as well. I'm going to drop that off to the side so you can see uh, both things that are running here. And uh, when, one interesting thing to note is that I start off my projects um, with the same basic code no matter I'm also working with. So this particular um, set of uh, code I use over and over and over again. Um, there is a uh, a camera. There is a um, camera subscriber. So basically, the the thing that's going to receive the camera video. And then there's other things that I might do, like uh, recognize specific images or specific types of things. Um, also, run some motors. Uh, uh, I might just start up the, the robot and have it do, do a bunch of things, like in this case here, I'm starting the robot world, awesome, it's not doing much of anything, and then uh, that's it. Um, and this one, when I'm receiving that command saying I'm starting the robot, a little bit more, it's um, looking around, seeing if it can find some faces. Um, Actually, that's the wrong one. Um, subscribe to this one. Uh, this one is uh, is just initializing the the motors. Um, it's moving them around, and making sure they they're free and clear of movement, and um, that's about it. Uh, and and then the this this one, like I said before, um, will actually um, initialize uh, initialize the cameras, um, and then start. Uh, posting a camera image. So not much uh, code here. Uh, here is here's the face subscriber so you can we're going to run this one here in a second so you can see uh, exactly what it's doing. But basically the demo we're going to run today is uh, the camera looking and seeing um, and then uh, putting a box around the face that it finds um, and then also letting us know if it's seen that person before um, and then with the box, uh, we probably won't do this one today, but we'll move the, the wheels around so that the person find, uh, follows, the robot follows the face. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, uh, launch this. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run uh, the things that you see here. 
in setup.py. This is all Python that we're running. Um, you can in, in this particular um, uh, functioning uh, operating system or package system, um, the, you can run Python or uh, C++. I, I use a combination of both. In this particular project is all Python, but a lot of times I'll run uh, C files, C++ files, and Python at the same time. Uh, in this one, uh, setup.py starts the interaction um, um, of my my main uh, programs that I want to run, and also will initialize any parameters that I, I want to initialize. We're going to run these uh, individually, and also if I wanted to. Uh, run some tests. It will run some tests on the the robot before I start it moving. Um, in this case, we're just going to run uh, publish this right here, um, and we're going to run subscribe. So we start out with the um, the package that we want to run, pi uh, pub sub, I think it's called, and then um, we're going to add in the the publish um, file. So basically this is going to start our camera. Oh, maybe if I was smart enough to actually say Ross run. Sorry about that. Missed a word. There we go. Real time. I won't edit that out so you can see that even developers make some mistakes. So it's going to start um, Initializing, I've uh, got an error because uh, uh, I've already, I'm already running the camera, but let me stop real quick. Um, 